There we go. Okay. Well, it's all it's it's freaking the fuck out. That's so wild. Lima beans, hot vote, voodoo, vash, and zek versus trivia about carnivore, Siberian alpha. Yeah. Okay. They're passing bands. Should be quick. Everyone's picking the same comp. Clean. How'd your power go out? Yeah. I don't know. That that's really unfortunate. I mean, it happens. So. Why'd I let Hoppo back? Hoppo's fine. Hoppo can play. Hoppo's been a sub and he's a mod, so I'm not I'm not too worried. What's the point in banning? Um well that was actually a mistake on their part, really. The biggest thing here is that we got a full team comp. Hopefully they can play it out. We'll see how it kinda goes. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Oh, I got a donation. Gotta dip, but stay Gucci. Yo, Jim Lynn, thank you, man. Take it easy. Have a great day. Hope, uh, I hope you're having a good one. Thanks for the three bucks. Glad you enjoyed the stream, brother. God bless. It's very unfortunate when that, uh, those kind of things happen, but uh, what can you do, really? The biggest thing here is how is the red team going to play out the soul lane? Are they going to pressure soul lane? Or is it going to be an overall just pressure in all lanes? Or is Hotbow going to focus dual lane? I want to see uh, how Hotbow kind of plays jungle here. And also the biggest thing here is um, I want to see how the blue team responds to the global pressure of the red team. It's going to be it's gonna be hard. It's going to be hard for the blue team. We'll see. Their team comp is like eh. So. Bam Bamboya, how's it going? Kick Hotbow because he's trash. <laughs> yeah. Just waiting for the game to start right now. Oh, man. This is hard because I have nothing else to talk about, so I'm just like sitting here like, what the fuck? All because of the, uh, the Subex power going out. Very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Oh, but it happens. It's not too big of a deal. Why is it, why are people going so hard on Hotbow? I don't know, everyone hates Hotbow, it's so funny. I don't know why, it's just like, everyone roasts the fucking shit out of him. By the way, guys, these sub games are for prizes. So if you're if you're a viewer that wants to participate, you have to subscribe, subscribe away, and then sync up to the Discord, and you can join. And there will be prizes, skin codes, and all that shit. So I'm excited because I get to see some very garbage games and and practice my casting, which I guess is pretty beneficial. Practicing my casting, I could always cast an event. But it's like solo casting. Usually you have kind of like the second caster. So like when you don't have anything to say, you can just kind of stop and then they pick up on you and then it works. But it's like I'm picking up on myself and I'm talking so fucking much about fucking nothing. What's your favorite feature of the Toyota Prius? You got to go. Can you dye your leg hair? See, no, what the f you guys have weird ass questions on oh, God. Hoppo has no hairline. How are you going to roast his hairline, bro? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, shit. You could cast sub slash viewer games. Now, I want sub games because I want fucking money. All right, because you guys come in here and like, honestly, the biggest thing is my viewers come in here and they're like, hey, ally, Maddie W. And I'm like, why don't you subscribe to me? You watch me all the time. No, I gave all my money to Maddie Pocket, so like I'm not going to. And I'm like, oh, well, that's that that hurts. <laughs> that sucks, dude. Game finally started. Finally. Oh no, am I having that bug? No way. No way. That bug is still a thing. My mouse. I I, I can't. I don't have a mouse. Damn, that sucks. I gotta restart. Fuck, dude. I hate Smite. I 
hate smite. Why why does this happen to me? I'm just gonna respect it anyway. Oh, we got some allied W's in the chat. I appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Sorry for the technical difficulties. This is wild. Maddie sends toe pics. I could send toe pics. You gotta add me in my Snapchat. You know what I hate about Snapchat, though? Some of you guys are weird as fuck. Some of you guys are weird as fuck, honestly. This caster is a noob. I'm not a noob. I'm not a noob. You can't tell me that, bro. Lima beans. Okay. Spectate. Lima beans. Yay. Go to match. I've sent you snaps before, but I don't think I'm weird. I think you're weird. Everyone's weird. All right, our mouse actually works this time. We're getting into the game. Very excited to actually get everything fucking working. Everything's matched up almost. Oh, baby. Okay, Lima Beans, Vash, Hotbow, Voodoo, and Zek on the blue team versus Zero Raptor, Carnivore, Olivier, and Siberian Alpha. I mean, in trivia bot, really. Yo, Cookie, Cookie. Cookie Gunner, thanks for the Twitch Prime subscribe. Make sure you sync up to the sub Discord. Um, and thank you. I do appreciate your contribution to the church. How did I like the Spring Fling? It was pretty good. Honestly, Spring Fling, I, I just got extremely high. I'm not going to lie. I just smoked the ganja. And it was a good time. And I could say that on stream because I have. Legally, I can smoke the ganja. I have a card. <laughs> so, shout out to Cancer. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's really all I can say. Shout out to Cancer. Stare down going down. Trivia bot. Really just chilling. Hotbow's like, fuck you, guy. <laughs> Want to see where Hotbow actually kind of starts? Ooh, what the fuck is Hotbow doing? We got another subscriber, yo, Falcon. Thanks for three months in a row. Hotbow looks like he's just going to start uh, speed, but I've seen this start before. Um, Mifflin on Xbox actually does a start. And the only that we have a fight. I'm not too sure why Zek is taking this fight. Uh, maybe he has pluck. He does pluck into the tower. I don't know if I agree with that. He's going to have zero clear for this. Meanwhile, Hotbow soloing the speed buff is going to be a little bit Thor is actually not that good at clearing buffs in my opinion it just takes way too fuck look how long this takes damn meanwhile in the soul lane man he really is plucking Zek is out here plucking at level 1 he has no clear no way of actually kind of uh, dealing with this uh, Voodoo is actually here the Athena randomly and we have a small grouping 4 people at the uh, Ellie's this is crazy. Meanwhile, what the hop? Oh, hello? What is he? He's really in here. He's like, hey guys, what's up? And he just gets completely poked out. Not too sure if I agree with that play. That was just, uh, that was interesting. Meanwhile, in the duel lane, we actually have a 1v1 potentially happening, but, um, Rama able to outclear the who he as expected. Three man kind of grouping in the mid lane here. Nothing crazy happening. Meanwhile, on the soul lane, we have poor Zek. He's getting completely bullied out of farm. Uh, looking at his build, he only has Mark of the Vanguard boots. He has zero way of clear. This is this is actually like the worst thing for Sova because he's just sitting here. He's like, I cannot clear to save my life. Like, like he's just please. But a little bit of help from the jungler is able to actually do something. God bless. And that's the biggest thing with Guardian Soul is you need a little bit of help, and I think that's okay. Like, it's okay, you gotta help the lane, bro. Wanna see if maybe they go for Trivia Bot. He's only level 2. He could very easily die. Oh, the pluck, though, is clean. He's gonna take a little bit extra damage. Zach! Oh, if the double tap hit, that was definitely a uh, potential kill. Meanwhile, Invade, Voodoo, and, and Poseidon trying. They're trying so hard. I think they actually steal the red buff, but they potentially could... Die here. We have a Poseidon great meditation, but not enough to slow his clean. And the very greedy invade. 
Oh, the Polk. Even cleaner. Voodoo getting completely stomped out. Whoa. Red team credit with the first two kills. That double tap. So clean out of Zero Raptor. And really, that was just a, a bad decision. Uh, obviously, there was no pressure. No no way our Thor or Sobek could have rotated. So, I think that was uh, not the vision. Not the vision there for the blue team. Looks like we have a small invade over here on the red buff. Voodoo making sure it doesn't happen. The portal's clean. Gev gets out. Not too sure. Like another uh, greedy decision making. Blue team able to kind of come in. Uh, Hoppo looks like he's in. The whirlpool's clean. And Geb. Whoa, the meditation. <gasps> no pushback. He might actually be able to live the pull into the tower. Oh, but Lyman B gets the snipe from all the way at Gold Fury. Clean. I respect it. I really do. That was a great snipe. It was great awareness on his part to rotate and help out. I Meanwhile, on the soul lane, big fight going down. Sobek really just kind of getting in that ass. But with Erlang's all, he's able to actually heal up a little bit. Thor could definitely invade. Blue buffs going up. Thor in the air. Is this a dive? <gasps> he has no idea. Oh, he's getting slammed down. Oh, oh, Hoppo completely messing up the combo. Stopping. His dash, but not able to get the kill. That that could have been a kill if he did it correctly, but Hoppo kind of hesitated there because he sucks dick. Red team able to respond, looking to just do their buffs, and there's no way for an invade to happen for the blue team. That is insane, bro. That is wild. The red team actually able to... To still a, a trivia bot completely had no idea. It's just the uh, hot bows mechanics are just not as clean as I thought. Rama, level seven versus level six, one kill apart. It's very obvious why the Rama's ahead. He just has a better laning phase than Huyi. But Zero Raptor definitely has a ton of kill potential. Uh, looking at the build, Zero Raptor actually going trans too. So transcendence Huyi, he's gonna be hitting very hard. I mean, I'm excited to see how mid game goes for. For our, our friend here. Trivia bot. Able to get a kill on Vash. Red team up another kill. One to three. Completely missing that. Small grouping here by both teams. I like I like the grouping. Everyone's doing things together. It's very it's very fun to watch. Because you get to see the tactics, the strategy of how uh these teams are going to engage each other. Feels almost high level. But I I think everyone's aware, like, you know what? I'm trying to get some gems and shit, bro. What is this? I'm just doing sub games right now. Camon is really good. I uh, like seeing your reaction. The only thing with Camon, I have nowhere to really put my face. I guess I, c I don't know. There's nowhere for me to really, uh, yeah, put my face. So I don't want to block any sort of action. You know what I mean? I guess I could do Camon. But uh, I'd be blocking a little bit. Let me know. What do you guys think? Camon or Cam off for casting? What do you think? Let me know. Let me know. Oh, meanwhile, actually, a gank on the soul lane. Completely caught out of position. Trivia bot goes down. That was that was a, it was just a clean gank. <coughs> but red team, yeah, red team have no way to actually kind of respond to that. There's no objective up besides gold fear, but they um, they're a little bit late there. I mean, not even the Yan assault. But trivia bot going down shouldn't affect him too hard. It looks like he's still on par with the Sobek. Um, it depends on how he builds here. I wonder if he's going to go like a hide of the urchin. We see he started cloak one. Make the cam smaller. You can move the map. Can I really? Just make the cam smaller. Cam off, cam off. Size the cam. Okay, 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 okay. God damn, you guys are, you guys are hurting my feelings at this point. Let me see. Uh, mm -mm. Order. Move up or down. Hold on. We'll resize the camera. What the? Where'd I go? Whoa! Super small. I'm sorry I'm like in the middle of the screen. Well, that's pretty good. I think that's a good size. Dun, dun, dun. I just gotta uh, fix it real quick. 
There we go. So you guys can see not my green screen. Okay, back to the action. Sorry about that. Your head is just too big. Fuck you, idiot. My head is perfect. Ooh. Ooh, big scratch right there. All right, so not too sure what I missed, but two to three. Blue team, the red team. Full screen your face, please. Yeah, just have my face. Just cover up everything. That's pretty clean. Clean, clean, clean. All right. I, I respect it, boys. I respect it. All right. Thank you guys for telling me that. I didn't realize my cam was just too big uh, for you guys. I, I I think this is a perfect size. You guys get to see my... Ah! Like, I could just be like that. Uh, looking at the gold, it's actually pretty even. Blue team with a slight lead. Really, the biggest thing here is I want to see the red team, like, kind of frag out. I mean, we have a kill on Susan. Uh, Level-wise, Hotbow completely out farming. Olivier, small gank. I mean, well, really more of just poke pressure. Soling wise, trivia bot's doing okay. Looks like he's going to a cloak very early, or maybe a hide of the urchin. I'm not too sure where he's gonna go with this cloak of concentration. We'll see. Maybe he goes spirit rope. You never know. Spirit rope would actually be very good considering the CC coming out of the team. So I I would respect the spirit rope um, pickup. Rama doing his buffs. We have a small engagement. Voodoo being very aggressive, but this could d definitely be a kill for the Poseidon. The slow is there taking it off. Oh, but there's the counter gank. Hotbo in the fray, but he's taking way too much damage. There's the beads. And blue team forced to back up. Maybe they'll pressure. Gold Fury is definitely uh, a vision right now. And I respect that red team immediately rushing to the Gold Fury. No way to respond. Really, I want to see if Rama... He could very easily steal it. There's the Athena all. They're going in. Who ye? Red team get the gold fury. Wonder if the team fight's gonna go down. Oh, Oliver completely taken out. Oh, but the jump in by Zero Raptor. Let's see what he kind of goes for. Rama is the vision right now, but they actually choose to peel back onto Zek. Completely out of position. There's the pin. Thor hotbows in. Zero Raptor goes down. Blue team getting two kills there, but Gold Fury going to the red team. Even game so far. Even, even, even. So let's see what the blue team does to respond on that. They'll probably just pressure mid. There's no uh, buffs to actually take. So mid harpies, left side, spawning very soon. How is traveling with Herb on you? Do they give you a hard time at airports? Actually, it's not that bad. I just kind of... Don't tell them. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, I've had I, I've had her by me. It's I I don't recommend doing that. But yeah, I mean I can't carry just like straight weed. I have I just the only thing I carry on me would be liquid. So uh, I, I think that's pretty reasonable having marijuana liquid. I don't know. But I would be able to explain myself at the airport even if they are like, what is this marijuana doing here? I'd be like, all right, well I have a card, bro. Um. Yeah, like I medically actually need it so I can deal with the pain of having stage 4 cancer. And they'd be like, oh, okay, you're free to go. <laughs> but it, it really depends. I haven't gotten in trouble for it yet, but oh, gang coming down the dual lane. Who you ult for the self peel? I would love to see a Rama ult right now, but now... Uh, the counter gank is there. Nice Athena ult may be able to actually do something. The pole is clean. Bead's a little bit late. No way for them to secure it, but Oliver gets the kill. Sylvanas ult. Oh, uh, the Kraken, not as clean. Oh my goodness. Completely caught out. Vash getting taken out. And the blue team on the back foot yet again. Red team really trying to uh, to make the vision happen. They're, they're doing the things right now. And I, and I love it. I think it is great. The the coordination coming out of this team is just fucking mm, clean. Oracle's going down to the red team. I respect the Zero is very pushed up, pressuring the dual lane as hard as he can. Which is really what he should be doing, especially when the blue team have no way of responding. Hotbo, nowhere to be found. Hmm. When I go to Expo, we're rolling all day, Cloud. We are going to get fucking... I'm going to be like, who are you? That's how zooted I'm going to get. Looking at the build, Suzano. Heartseeker. Looking at Mace 1, probably Yotun's Wrath, maybe a Brawler's. Um, I respect it. We have Hu Yi going trans, probably going to the Aussie build. 
Um, the greedy way would be like a kins or some shit, but I respect that Aussie would be uh, the, the vision right now. Voodoo being aggressive. I love this. Baiting out the dash. Forcing Voodoo to back the fuck up. Zero Raptor doing well. Oh, I love it. Love it. Love it. Making sure she doesn't get a free back. You got to back all the way, baby. Hot bow. Uh, very inaccurate with the wall, but they have no idea the portal demon's going on. Hot bow. Uh, maybe he's just checking. He's like, hmm, but they could be doing portal demon, but actually forced to back up. Great peel from the geb. Not able to get anything. Cataclysm clean. Uh, the Poseidon cracking a little bit off. I don't think the blue team should take this fight. They could go in. It really depends. Giannis is low mana. But, uh, I, I don't... Ooh! Completely actually catching him on the read. I respect it. Oliver goes down. But Hotbo goes down in return. Portal out! Carnivore credit with the kill. God bless. Great Giannis play overall. Taking a look at the player damage. Hotbo on top. As expected, he did have a clean early game. But Olivier and Giannis right there with the Meanwhile 1v1 going down. Rama is the target. Creep wave trying to block some shots. Got to hit the autos. Rama does have more attack speed. The backup. Rama in the air. Can, can, can he get all three? No. Misses the last one. All right. The play here would be... Oh! Jumps away. Okay. I respect it. I respect it. The play here would have been to mark him. Jump in place with the knock up. And then get the double tap with the stun. But uh, very... Very, very awkward 1v1. Really. No kill ha kind of happening. Both teams kind of chill. Golfier is spawning very soon. Golfier is spawning very, very soon. Excited for that. Nothing really kind of happening. Speed buff spawning for Hotpa. He could choose to take it. Mid right harpies are still available. Farm on the map. Oracle spawning soon. I want to see a fight for Oracles. I think Oracles is just such a big priority buff. And I, I respect it. Zero Raptor. Oh, actually, just starting the Gold Fury. Blue team have no idea. Hoppo non position. It's at half health. Um, maybe they'll try to come in. There it is. They're just like, hmm, they could be doing Gold Fury. And Gold Fury. Should very easily be going down. Red team, they're completely great taunt though. Carnivore not having beads is going to die. 4v5 situation trivia bot all by himself. The 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 ult is good. He's able to heal this all up. But uh, Hoppo in the air looking for a fight. Red team forced to back up. They definitely should not be taking this fight. Geb needs to back the fuck up. Roll out not clean. Getting caught out. Siberian Alpha yet again getting caught. That's unfortunate to really see. He's also two levels behind. And blue team with a full five band group and can definitely push down the mid tier tier one. Really depends on uh Yeah, yeah, mid tier one is the vision right now. And I respect it. This is good. There's gonna be a lot of map control. Zero Raptor though, he might take advantage and actually push the tier one himself. Rama recognizing that his tier one could get pushed. And it, it is getting pressured. So it's going to be a tier 1 for tier 1, which is actually a pretty good play. Uh, good awareness. Recognizing, but the 1v1 might be going down. Ooh, missing the stun. There's the Athena ult. And it looks like... Great, great ult. He could still even 2v1. Oh, it depends. He's getting completely cut out. The Sanctuary not clean. And the snipe is good. Lima Beans credited with the kill. I respect it, really. Uh, Zero Raptor trying as hard as he can to at least get the, uh, the trade before he dies. But it's good. He did force a lot of ults. There was Thor ult, Athena ult, and Rama ult. So they're not going to be able to fight for a little bit. Overall, very good indirect pressure. Now the red team have a little bit chance to, to catch up. And when you have pressure like that, especially coming out of the dual lane, it's more of like, <gasps> okay, I can I can uh, get my farm and, and kind of catch up here. Even though Zero Raptor did die, it was still good pressure. The ping is out. Looks like the call, the vision here for the blue team is this tier one. And they're going to be able to get it clean. Not so sure what the red team is doing. They have plenty of chance to catch up. Uh, very unaware. Olivier, uh, maybe not quite responding. Experience-wise, the red team is actually kind of behind. I mean, Trivia Bot's doing really well, but he's not really a part of uh, the action kind of going on here. So, hmm. can we have an EU sub viewer games? It depends. I mean, like I, I'm NA. I don't know how many European people there are, so like I don't I don't think I have enough subs to do that. If I had enough European subs that were just purely European, I'd be like, okay, that's fine. Oh, uh, the poll 
Actually, I think that missed, but the ult is clean and Poseidon getting taunted. Great Kraken, though. Oliver going down. Vash still trying to stay alive. Sanctuary clean. Trivia bot credit with the kill. Hotbo trying to get in the air. He's definitely going to be on the retreat. And uh, one for one trade, but I think that it goes in favor of the red team. I don't know if they know Portal Demon spawning soon. They could definitely pressure the tier one. Depends on how they pressure here. Pin is good. A little bit of poke, but oh my goodness. Sobek is so tanky. Bulwark or Hope into Breastplate. This man is just in a tank. I mean, he's not going to have too much damage, but he's going to be very unkillable until uh, penetration is started for the honest here. Portal Demon spawning. Oracles also available. Wonder if that's going to be the vision for Zero Raptor, and it is, which I respect. Nothing really happening. Blue team kind of buying items, not really doing too much. Nothing really happening. I would like to see vision, maybe ward control. Which there it is. The ward is out. Being able to see if Portal Demon. I I think the um both teams kind of recognized it. The ping is out. That should be the next objective to fight for. It depends. Red team have a couple of options. Can get red buff. I would probably do red buff into pressuring mid. Getting this tier 1 down would make getting portal demon so much easier. But they need to pick. And it really depends. And Hoppo would be a prime target to pick here. Considering he's very greedily stealing buffs. Took red buff for free. And I think that's just uh, unawareness. We, I'd like to see a little bit more aggressive intention out of Oliver. Because uh, right now he's just getting... Completely bullied in the jungle by uh, Hoppo. So Hoppo's being very uh, aggressive. And he's not really getting too punished for it. I mean, it, we see more defensive play out of the red team, which is warranted because there's no tier 1. So they don't have the map control or the vision to uh, actually kind of deal with it. Can you order the gods and item lists by roll like they do in the. I think I did, didn't I? Yeah, it's actually, it's all matched up, so I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Gold Fury is spawning soon. Portal Demon's still available. I think Gold Fury is the vision for both teams right now, though. War Control going to the red team. They have full vision. Oliver actually getting cracked him. Sanctuary is out. He's not, maybe not able to actually get out. Oh, he is. Rama in the air. Looking for the snipe. Geb shield clean. Oh my goodness. All three shot. Lima Beans credited with the kill. He's playing... Amazing on this Rama Thor ult. Meanwhile, on the backside, Geb is the vision. Blue team looking. They're reaching, but they're not able to actually get Geb. But Gold Fury is the uh, next objective. And, and now, a Gold Fury finally going to the blue team. It depends. Trivia Bot may be able to steal. I don't think so. And there it is. Blue team have destroyed the Gold Fury. Giannis all out. Looking for kills. Red team's mad. A little bit of poke going out, but Giannis actually completely by himself. Oh my goodness. I think he thought that portal would work, and Lima Beans cut out the kill. Way too aggressive. Carnivore completely out of position. Trying to make something happen. Not exactly working. Geb yet again out of position. Still relatively even, but blue team do have a slight lead. Geb is going to be going down. Not too sure uh, what he's doing. Not too sure. And red team completely out of position. Yet again. Not to show how Red Team's gonna do this, really. Thor doing so well. Hoppo 6 and 1. He's making, he's making all the things kinda happen. The biggest play there was the three snipes from Lima Beans able to actually montage. Oh, did that steal? No. Very close. Very close. Susana ult down. Blue team able to secure the portal demon and the gold fear. A huge gold swing in their favor. And experience wise, they are so far ahead. The biggest thing is red team needs to farm a little bit more efficiently if they're going to want to compete for these objectives so the blue team doesn't get too far ahead. I mean, they've been doing pretty well in team fights because of misplays out of the blue team, but really the biggest thing is they just need to farm a little bit more efficiently. Oracle's going down to the blue team. Objective-wise, all tier 1 on the dual lane and mid lane are down, so there's so much map control lost for the red team. Not able to actually do anything. They really need this tier 1 and mid down. I think that would help. I mean, tier 1 is down for the soul lane, but there's no focus over there. There's no fire giant attempts, and portal demon is down, so it's not going to really affect anything. Also, with Hoppo's aggressive nature, being so aggressive, he's setting the pace of the match really well. Red team not really able to respond. 
Goldfear actually being no nope, not Goldfear Ward being taken out. Hoppo looking for some poke. Olivier would be the best target. Poke out the Susano. I would like to see him maybe go for a pull in, poke out the Thor, but I don't think he's actually going to be able to do that or close the distance. Red team just kind of stay. Look at look at the pressure right now. Hoppo's doing by just kind of staring at people. He's looking for a poke target, but he's not able to actually get anything. But because of this pressure, he has red team on their toes, which might be good. I'm not too sure. Gab is in. The rollout's clean. Knocks him back. Hoppo back the fuck up. Meanwhile, in the soul lane, Trivia about way out of position. Not too sure what he was going for there. That was that was wild. Really not too sure. Uh, I think he was just unaware of the blue team rotating. I mean, it's really team fight time. Laning phase is over. I don't think he should have been pushed up that far. I don't think that was the play. Fire Giant being stuttered up for the blue team, which I do. This is this is definitely the vision. I mean, it is at half health, but it could very easily be stolen. I would like to see them actually fight for it, but they're not actually going for it. Lima Bean still committing on this. It's so low. Blue team do get the Fire Giant, and the team fight is out. Gab completely low. Forced to roll. He might actually be able to get away. There's no way to close the distance and red team back up. Uh, that, that was still very scary. Could have very easily went to the red team and that would have been quite the turnaround. But blue team with all five people with the fire giant. Oh my god, the pick is good. Great jump. But Olivier runs in the traffic there. Actually gets Dracoed. Pressure's out. Rama's looking for the soul lane. Lama Bean, Lama Bean's playing so well in this fucking Rama. Very unexpected, but Lama Bean's is... Uh, He's making the things happen right now. I mean, he's up there with Hotbo, but yeah. Tier 2 going down. Tier 2 pressure on the soul lane. A lot of things happening, and the red team have no way of responding. Huge swing, really. Taunt out. Poke onto Zero Raptor. Hotbo is really in by himself. Meanwhile, on the back lane, yeah, Hotbo is the target. Sanctuary B, though. Maybe able to actually get out. Rama's there, though. He's looking for something. Not, not actually able to get anything, but they can definitely easily pressure a Phoenix at this point. Depends on how they want to do it, but no, uh, the focus here is get all the tier twos, get all the towers, get all the map control, and then maybe push a Phoenix, which Gold Fury spawning soon. I think tier two to Gold Fury back pressure of Phoenix would be the play. Uh, we'll see if the blue team actually decides to do that or not. Blue team just kind of securing everything, taking everything they can, getting as far ahead as possible before they go for the final Phoenix push. Oracles and red buff going to the blue team. It's, like I said, this is going to be a huge swing of gold in their favor, and I think they're very aware of Fury is spawning right this second. And they still have all their buffs to get, so now with this swing, blue team... Yeah, they're able to really get everything. I mean, red team, the biggest thing is they're making too many misplays. They had, they had potential to win this game, but it's not looking so good right now. They could still maybe hold on a Phoenix. It depends on uh, how this plays out. Hobo could very easily spaghetti and just die. He doesn't have any actives for this final push. There's a very long cooldown. Um, I don't know. Like, 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 the blue team really have to kind of misplay to lose this game. <sighs> Portal Demon spawning soon. Blue team looking to take that. Which the Fire Giant is being kind of wasted right now. Fire Giant should be uh, spawning soon. I mean, not spawning. Yeah, yeah, yeah it, it should be actually spawning soon. So, um, yeah, Fire Giant is going to wear off very quickly. Portal Demon going down to the blue team. Uh, maybe they still have a chance to push for a Phoenix, but they're going to need a pick. Which they could very easily get. Voodoo is being so aggressive on this team. The taunts have been absolutely um, crucial to this team's win. So Voodoo is doing extremely well. In terms of pressure. like I mean this is really top tier support play. Forcing beads. Initiating team fights. Voodoo is the person to look at when in terms of initiation. The Sobek is really good too. But Voodoo is really blowing beads, taunting everyone, and being relatively safe. I mean, 0-1-10, that's, that's a support score. You really, that's what you strive for. Meanwhile, in the Soul Lane, Hoppo in the air. I think it's getting a little bit caught out here. 
Um, Fire Giant still on them. They're going for the mid Phoenix. The push is there. Great two man stun out of Hoppo, but uh, he doesn't have anything to actually survive here. He is getting focused down. He might still die. Trivia bot credit with the shutdown. Great damage out of Zek. Whoa, and the wipe is there. Red team completely caught out. Oh, uh, Voodoo looking maybe for the taunt. And Trivia bot is down. Geb completely by himself, and that should be game. Kraken just to secure, and now. The red team's Titan getting completely destroyed. Lime Beans with the triple kill. What a wipe. What a game, bros. What a game. Gonna do the straw poll. Who was MVP? Who was MVP? Was it Hoppa on the Thor? Was it Lime Beans on the Rama? Was it Voodoo on the Athena? Zek on the Sobek or Vash on the Poseidon. Thank you so much, Hotbo. Finally, the subscribe. Creating the poll right now. Let me know, guys. Who was MVP? Who am I giving gems to? Because that, uh, that was a game. That was a game. I'm looking, Lima Beans is, is really, he's destroying the pole right now. I'm going to do a quick commercial, and we'll start the next game, ASAP. Thank you guys so much for watching. What the f-